welcome back to another vlog. I just got back from Pure Bar class and tidied up some things around the house, made my go-to protein smoothie, the usual. Um, I This morning at my Pure Bar class, I ran into a friend from camp, which was so fun. Um, if you needed a one like main personality trait about me, it's that I loved summer camp growing up. I I think I went for like 11 summers and then I was a counselor afterwards and it still in my everyday life has continued to be the most valuable and plentiful, I don't even know, like it's it's the truly the gift that keeps on giving because no matter where I am, no matter what city I'm in, I always will know someone because of camp. And even when Grant and I lived in Boston, we did not know a single soul. And I was working at a retail store and in walks in my camp counselor from when I was a camp my senior year. And then I later found out another friend from camp worked two stores over and lived in Boston. Literally my only friends that I had in Boston were camp people. And then we later met a couple who the girl like was, it went to camp and anyway, they're now some of like our best friends. <laughs> like being reconnected, you know, outside of camp and in a different phase of life. But anyway, I just always think that it's just so crazy how camp continues to be such a huge part of my life. So many years after the fact, I haven't been back to camp in probably like three years. I guess the last time I was a counselor was 2019, I think. I'm gonna shower and get dressed. Grant is still on his run, so I'm gonna go ahead and shower and then make coffee when he gets back. showered and dressed. I'm just wearing this cute little athleisure, athleisure set. The brand is Whiskey Active. I will link it. It's already linked in my LTK, but um, I'm just gonna put this on a little work from home look. Currently dealing with a technical issue with my Instagram, but it'll be okay. Grant's helping me with it and just need to sit down, get some work done. And then I need to run some errands later. I need to get a car wash and get some new washer fluid in my car. Anyway, all the things. Gonna sit down and get some work done. Okay, just a little bit later, Grant is making his sandwich. Uh -huh. I just made the salad that I made yesterday because it was so good. It's just a quinoa salad that uh -huh. has quinoa, cucumbers, red bell peppers, chickpeas, microgreens, cilantro, green onion, and then a little dressing I did, which is like soy sauce, olive oil, sriracha, and honey. Really tasty. Um, I never got my technical issue figured out. I looked, there's like an issue I was having with ManyChat that apparently a lot of people are having the same issue where links are not being sent when I do the comment for links feature, which is extremely frustrating because it's supposed to be a time saver. It's supposed to be helpful for y'all. And I also pay for it monthly. So trying to get that figured out. But anyway, got some other work done. Can eat this and then hopefully head out and run some errands that I need to get done. Okay, we are about to head out the door and run our errands. Need to go by the post office. Need to get a car wash. What are you laughing about? I thought you were talking to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is how I just talked to Grant. Um, like, this is what we need to do. But really, we need a car wash, postal, sir, post office, Whole Foods. Oh my gosh, y'all. Okay, we haven't left yet, obviously. Grant just ran to take Remy out and my rug got delivered. Rifle paper was so sweet and sent me a new rug for our living room. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this today. Mm, I'll have to, maybe I'll vlog into tomorrow. Mm, I don't know. I'm definitely making a reel about it. So stay tuned for that. <laughs> Yay, I'm so excited. Okay, we're back from all of our errands. I thought I would do a little Whole Foods haul. I just needed a handful of things. And so we just picked up 
we just picked them up real quick. First, they use something we've been loving, and it's this Athletic Brewing Co. It's like beer, but it's really low alcohol, really low calories, but tastes just like some of our favorite beer. And so we don't work, we can feel like we can enjoy it during the week and like whatever. It's just like really refreshing and it's not high in calories and it, it tastes really good. And it's great in like the summertime when it's so hot. And sometimes I just love like a cold beer and we really like this one a lot. Next are these chips. This is probably our, our fourth time going back to purchase these from Whole Foods, these tortillas. We love these, just plain or with guacamole. We've had these before, this is our favorite flavor. And then we also grabbed these nacho flavors to try. So we love these, so good. And then I just got some boring stuff like some quinoa because we were out of it, garbanzo beans for my salads that I like to make. I got some parsley and pasta shells for, I'm making stuffed shells. I might make it tonight and I couldn't find stuffed shells at Trader Joe's and they were out of parsley. So pick these two things up. Okay, the last thing that we got, y'all know we love the Trader Joe's chocolate chip cookie ice cream sandwiches. They're so good, they're our favorite. I forgot to pick some up when I was at Trader Joe's the other day, but this is like a close alternative. However, these were like $8 and there are only three in here. So we're balling out, but they're these Cool House classic vanilla ice cream sandwiches. We'll have to do a tasting review on these tonight if Grant has one, but yeah, very bougie ice cream sandwiches. <laughs> and that was all for a haul. Now I'm gonna put on my tennis shoes and we're gonna take Remy on a walk. Bye. Good job. Right here, right here. Hello. Okay, we're back from our walk. I'm getting started on dinner. Stuffed shells tonight. I'm following this super easy recipe that I found online. My mom, growing up, my mom would always make stuffed shells for us. And I remember always really liking them, but I feel like her recipe was like a way more intricate than this, or maybe it just tasted way more intricate than this. Um, I also feel like hers had spinach in it, but I can't remember. This one doesn't have any spinach in it, but We'll see how it goes. I'm gonna like whip it up and get it all set to go in the dish to bake and then I'll shower while it's baking. But tonight, Grant and I are going to put together the new little footstools that I got to go with the rug. We're doing like a whole refresh in the living room and I'm so excited for it to come together. Grant said we can do it tomorrow morning because, well, what's today? Rifle Paper is doing a Labor Day sale. I think it's happening now until like the end of Labor Day. So if you're looking for rugs or home decor, y'all know Rifle is our absolute favorite. If you've been following since Boston, that's when we got this rug in Boston. It is still my absolute favorite. I am in love with this rug. Like obviously we're gonna keep this and use this in a future space, in a future home. But um, I have just been feeling like it's, it's a lot of blue and you really have to like work around the blue. But don't get me wrong, I love it, but I'm just, I want something fresh. You know, I want to just change it up. These footstools have seen better days. I love them so much but this happened on the way to Boston and they just are like really beat and they're also extremely heavy and just not easy to move and I'm just ready for something new. So I'm really excited about the rug. I think it's gonna look great. Um, I can't wait to see it all come together. Even Grant was telling me he was excited about the rug, which is so exciting. He usually, you know, he's the guy, he could care less. He's happy with whatever I do with the house. But um, anyway, oh, have I shown you the latest addition? I can't remember if I showed this in the last vlog. Ignore the laundry. I feel like laundry is always drying. But these two lamps I got from Home Goods. These were the ones that were in my office, but I just moved them down here. Ballard Designs Mirror. I'm really happy with this. It is so much brighter in here than it was before. And I'm just, the space makes me so happy now. It's like pleasant to look at. So, hey. But I also think that Trader's ice cream has more flavor. Like this cookie was good. Overall execution was good. But 
Uh, Trader's ice cream is better.